When you need to execute immediate operations on your 48, then you will use the execute command. Now, there are dozens of execute commands. Let me list the five best, most, at least in my opinion, useful executes command. Coming up. All right, so we start with the execute ping. Now, this is classic in just about any operation, any operating system out there. Um, let's just use the basic execute ping destination, and you will actually send five ping um, packets. Now you can use the execute ping options, and there you will have tons of options that you can play around, such as the interval, the count. Uh, uh, sending from different sources and so on. The number two command is the the execute disk list. Now this one will actually show you the different disks that are on your 48. If you have more than one disk then you will see the different disks each with its own reference now you will also see the different partitions you can format the different disk and you can actually scan them for errors so let me just show you you can actually use the execute disk scan and if i need to scan this one then i'll enter its reference number in that command all right, so another command is the execute this command, disconnect admin sessions. Now, this is great if you have more than one admin on your 48. It can be a professional admin that is uh, administrating another VDOM or any other part of your 48. And if you need to disconnect the admin who is logged in, then you can use the execute disconnect admin session. And here you have the different admin numbers. So I have currently two super admins, but let's assume that I need to disconnect uh, this one, then I will enter number zero. All right, now another command, which is another classic, is the execute backup config. And here you will actually uh, back up your configuration either to a USB disk or to a TFTP server and so on. The next command is one that I actually use often, which actually lists all the clients that are connected, all the clients that have gotten IP addresses from the different DHCPs on my video. So to use this command, you can use the execute DHCP list list and it will show up all the clients that got IP addresses on your 40 gate. And the last one is the execute log. Now you can do a lot with the execute log. You can actually back up your logs, your reports into uh, um, a specific path using a, a compressed folder you can filter categories you can do just about anything you can delete all logs uh, on your disk so you can do a lot with your execute log commands just uh, look at the documentation and uh, you will use that a lot